So Erin, why do you feel or think projects such as this need to be a little bit more common in elite sport within Great Britain? I think the athlete voice is really important. I think uh, over the last couple of years, um, lots of athletes have been speaking up and uh, really wanting to be a part of um, the NGB and they want the NGB to be something that they can be really proud of. And um, selection is such a key part of uh, any NGB and any high performance sport that it does make sense to sort of take in the athlete experience and see how athletes have uh, sort of engaged with the process in the past and, and what can be improved and, and what should stay the same. And I think that uh, the athlete voice going forward is something that can be really empowering. It can be really uh, reassuring for the athletes to feel like they're being heard by the NGB. Um, but then it's also really useful for the NGB to sort of have a bit of a sense check to see where they're operating at, where their weaknesses are, where their strengths are. And the athletes are such a key part of any sport that uh, it makes sense to engage the athlete body in an appropriate way and at the right time. But I think that's why this has been really successful. It's at the start of a season, at the start of a very exceptional season uh, before we're going into a you know the first ever postponed games. So it's a perfect time to really start to look at what are we doing well? How can we improve and how can we secure the future of British rank? Definitely. And I'm certainly hearing that as well across the high performance system and, and my role as athlete engagement manager. Athletes, they want to be involved in some of these sort of decisions where, as you mentioned, where it's, it's more appropriate um, and just, you know, canvassing that athlete opinion and, and the sport working together collaboratively, collectively with the athletes to move the sport onto a better place, um, I think is really, really important, and particularly in areas such as selection. Um, so I'm glad to hear that. Rowan have had such a positive step forward within this area and we're, we're certainly hopeful that other sports will look into this and, and equally want to build on their um, athlete voice and athlete voice mechanisms within their sport as well.